Hello, I'm Jan Chosen Bays, and I'm the co abbot of Great Vow Zen Monastery here in Klatskanai, Oregon, where we currently have about 20 residents, and also of the Heart of Wisdom Zen Temple in Portland, Oregon. In 1233, Zen Master Dogen wrote, When the truth does not fill our body and mind, we think that we have enough. When the truth fills our body and mind, we realize that something is missing. So 800 years ago, Dogen Zenji said, We think that we have enough. And now, how much more do we have? We can travel by air any place in the world. We can eat any kind of food. We have clothes filling our closets. We have cars and drones and bicycles and electric scooters. We have computers. We have Facebook friends. We have endless video games and thousands of movies that we can watch online. We have so much, but we are still not settled, not content not completely at peace in our heart-mind. Dogen Zenji wrote, From a boat on the ocean where no land is in sight, we see only a circle, and no other aspects are apparent. When we're completely absorbed in the circle that has me at the center, and my life as the circle of our awareness and importance, we think that we have enough. And yet, despite all of our attempts to keep ourselves entertained and busy, there is this dissatisfaction that nags at us and keeps us looking for what is missing. Dogen Zenji said, When the truth fills our body and mind, we realize that something is missing. That's exactly when we begin our spiritual journey. We have a vague memory of what we call our original nature, our true nature, from which we were born and which we will return to when we die. It is all around, behind, within, saturates everything. It calls to us from inside of us. It calls to us from everything. And it leads us to practice. When we first sit down on a cushion to meditate, we have this sense, oh, this is the way to find what is missing. Dogen Zenji tells us exactly what to do to find what is missing. He says, sit in a quiet place and do non-thinking. What is non-thinking? It is a practice. Kohen Ejo, who was a transmitted disciple of Dogen Zenji, said, If you don't propagate thoughts, they will not continue themselves. Constant thinking is what confuses us. It, what, it is what hides what we are looking for. It actually hides what is already here and what we already are. Dogen Zenji said, this is one of my favorite things, that he said, a deluded person and an enlightened person at the same time use one boat and neither is obstructed. In one boat, in one boat, in this one boat, in this one boat, in this one person, that is you. If you sit still and shift away from the thinking function of the mind to wide open awareness, to shikantaza, you will find what is missing. Actually, you will find what has never been missing. Peace and contentment and a simple happiness are right here, right now, always. Just sit and let go of the tangled stream of thoughts that hides us from us that hides what we are looking for from us. As Dogen Zenji promises, then the treasure house will open of itself and it will be yours to share and use at will. Thank you.